Hi there. In this video, we're going to talk about the first step of the funnel, our landing page. In this landing page, we will be offering something for free. It could be a guide, a checklist, a template. Um, it could be a worksheet. Anything that provides real value to your prospects. Now, the landing page is really important from two reasons. Number one, it's where you're building your email list. This is where the mass of the people are gonna come and get to know you. They're going to leave their email address and they're going to hope to get some type of value from you. The other reason it's really important is because, as we said, this is where people meet you for the first time. So you're setting expectations. You want to show people that they can trust you, that they're going to get high value content from you, and hopefully they'll understand that if they can get this high quality content from you for free, then they can expect even more from your paid products. So we're going to dive in into every section of this landing page. I'm going to explain the headline and the different sections and how you can use them, how you can adapt them to your product, and hopefully increase your conversions on the landing page and get many emails. Let's take a look at the landing page that we're talking about. So in front of you is the template. Um, this is the header section, and I'm going to start by breaking it down for you guys. So it says, it's time to say goodbye to boring, generic, barely converting landing pages. Landing pages that sell the six fundamental rules for creating high converting landing pages. Make meaningful changes to your landing pages so that you can continuously increase conversions and ROI. So I've broken down this headline, this entire um, header section, into two parts. Number one, it's time to say goodbye to boring, generic, barely converting landing pages. This is where I'm highlighting the pain. In Get Response, you can edit this into the pain that your prospects are probably feeling right now without your solution. So I'm mentioning the main pains that people have. And in the second part of the header, I say, I give them the promise, the actual value that people are looking for, the six fundamental rules for creating high converting landing pages. Now, whatever you're selling, whatever um, product you are giving for free, um, the template, the worksheet, the checklist that you're providing, this is where you want to spell it out for them, the value that they're going to get by signing up to your email list um, and with getting this checklist. Um, moving on to section number two. So, as I mentioned, in Get Response, you can um, you can edit all of this. So you just go in, you uh, double click, and you write down the text that you want. But I've provided this template so that you can easily edit it and start using it. In the second section, um, I've basically laid out what people are going to get. So it says, in this free guide, you'll learn how to look at any landing page and know exactly where the problem is, identify what people need to see when they land on that page, and understand the exact changes you need to make so more people convert. So what we're doing here is we're highlighting that value that people are getting. I'm constantly focusing on the end result. Um, so tell your readers, tell your landing page visitors exactly what they're going to find inside. Focus on the value they're going to get out of it, not the actual point. So if, for example, I could say in this, um, in this section, well, you're going to learn about the header of a landing page. You're going to learn, this is very meta, you're going to learn about the call to action button. You're going to learn about the images. But instead, I'm highlighting the value, exactly what they're going to get, the end result. And I'm briefly touching on how they can use this in different situations. So this is this part about what they're going to get. Remember, it's not the benefits that they're going to get, it's the value. The next section is actually the call to action button. Now you'll notice again, it says, never feel stumped when faced with a landing page again, ready to stop guessing and start converting. So again, in this section, I'm highlighting their pain, their struggles, and what they're going to get out of it. So it's not leave your email address and I'll send you the guide. It really is um, pushing towards that value again. Never feel stumped when faced with a landing page. And the call to action button is send me a free guide. Now I like to use long call to action buttons because they really do focus on the value for people rather than saying submit or start. I say, I, I actually put in the action 
the result that people are going to get. So this means it needs to be clear and we need to ask them to do just one thing. And remember, what we want from them is to leave their email address. Put in your email address and we will send you the guide that, we're promised, that was promised. So moving on to the next section, the what's inside section and the social proof. Now, what's inside section is giving prospects a glimpse of what they'll get when they sign up. Now again, this is, um, we want to highlight the value. So explain the purpose um, of what they're getting and the benefits. So how to analyze your landing page and find what needs fixing. The six fundamental rules for high converting landing pages. Um, three formulas for high converting call to action buttons. The complete checklist I use before I launch any landing page. So if in the first section, over here in this guide, I in this section, I highlighted the value that they get. In this section, I'm getting more into the nitty gritty. I'm explaining the actual sections they're going to learn, the content they're going to learn, but I'm still highlighting the value. Then I move into um, the about me. This is the social proof section. So essentially, I'm introducing myself. This is your chance to show people or to remind people if they've known you before, um, why they should download this amazing checklist from you or this guide from you specifically, why you are the person to sell it to them. So I've essentially um, divided this section in two sections. So introduce yourself. So I'm the founder of this company and I help my clients and students achieve these amazing results you've been dreaming about. So all you have to do is go into this template and put in the company that you work for um, or that you manage and put in the amazing results that people want to achieve. Then explain who you are. So after co-founding a successful X company and doing this, these amazing results for some of the largest brands in the world, today I do all the awesome things that you do. So essentially, you start by saying, this is who I am, this is what I've done, establish your credibility by saying, you know, these are the companies I've worked for, these are the stages that I've been on, these are the companies that trust me, these are the blogs that I've written for, and the call to action. If you'd like to learn how to get more people to say yes on your landing pages and achieve those record-breaking results you're after, join the academy below. So I introduced myself, I've added a photo of me, which obviously isn't a photo of me, um, and you introduce yourself. So hi there, I am your conversion expert because that's what I'm offering, but I'm introducing myself. And it says, grab a free copy of the guide and the call to action again, send me my free guide, and at the end of the page, the social proof, as it's seen on. Now, essentially, there's many different types of social proof that you can use on a landing page. You can use testimonials if you have, very powerful, reviews, um, and logos. So that's the idea here is to give people a sense of trust, that they can trust you, that other people trust you, that other people have used this guide or have taken your courses or know you. Um, people have given you um, five star reviews. The idea here is to really set people at ease and make them feel comfortable with leaving their email address and giving it to you for this value. Um, so this is essentially the landing page. Very, very simple. We have the header section, which is the big promise. We have the next section where we talk about the value and we introduce what people will be able to do with the guide that I'm providing or the checklist and the call to action. Next, we explain the benefits, the, the actual things people are going to get. So what, is the, what are the feasible benefits they're going to get? Rules, formulas, checklists. And we introduce ourselves. This is why you should trust us. This is why we are the people, or I am the person you should trust and download this guide from. And of course, the social proof where we seal everything with a sense of trust and um, an idea that they can really feel comfortable with leaving their email address with us to get this value that we're providing. So that is it. This is the landing page. Now, it's set up in GetResponse in an easy way where you can just simply go in and edit any of the sections, the image, the text, the copy, all of it. So go ahead, jump into it right now, and start editing your template. And feel free to ask the team any questions that you have. We're here for you. Talk soon in our next video.